Hey guys, it's Jasmine here and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you don't know who I am, I do everything from workout videos, hair care videos, skincare and makeup videos, and school related videos. Today is going to be a school related video. I'm going to share with you my tips on how I never miss a due date and always stay on top of every single assignment I have for college. It took me some time to figure out how I wanted to organize everything. I am a freshman and I'm going into my spring semester of my freshman year and uh, fall semester i not gonna lie it was kind of trial and error and seeing what works for me and i think i finally figured out what i like to do to make sure i am organized and i always am on top of assignments so let's get right into it the first tip i want to share with you today is right when you get your syllabus write your assignments down in your calendar don't wait till the last minute the week ahead you need to make sure that you write them down right when you get the syllabus so you are organized from the start of the class and you don't have to like work your way into being organized while the assignments are coming to the due dates and when I'm writing my assignments down in my calendar, I like to color code. All right, so here is my calendar here. This is for February and you can see that all of my classes are color coded and I will write the assignments that are due in that designated color that I have for each class. I love this trick because it makes sure I am organized and, and Okay, now after I write down every single assignment and due date in my calendar, the next thing I do is figure out specific days that I'm actually going to work towards ending and finishing that assignment. I like to spread out everything. I don't need like to cram because I feel like when I cram, I don't like put my best foot forward. And then especially with essays, I don't know how people do that. I just, I can't do it. The day I have the class is the day I'm going to only focus on that material and that homework. Whatever other classes I have that day I only focus on those and I ignore everything else for any other assignment that I don't have class for this helps my mind like just relax and not freak out if you look at every single assignment you have to do you will maybe get a little stressed out and and that might prevent you from actually finishing the assignment when you are doing assignments make sure that you break them up for example when I am writing an essay I would like to write an outline on one day and then the next day or the next day I have class I will write the rough draft and then the following um, week I'll, I'll revise it and then I'll finally get to my finished essay. Another thing that I like to try when I'm studying or just doing work, I like to use a timer. Especially when I am studying for a, an exam like my uh, midterm or my final exams, whenever I am studying for that test, I use a timer. So for example, if a class is let's say an hour and a half long each day, then I will set a timer for an hour and a half and study that entire time. I don't know about you, but whenever I use a timer, I feel like that I am more motivated to do the work because I know that I am going to be done at a certain time and also because I'm trying to like use my time wisely. A timer is such a motivator for me. I don't Checklists are another big thing that I love to use because it's another type of reward I get from checking every single thing off my list. It's just something about that actually like physical motion of me checking it off and also the visual cue too of me seeing that I'm actually being productive and actually doing things throughout my day it gets me to keep on going and doing all the assignments and finishing things. And it just makes me happy when I check off every single thing off of my checklist. My last tip today is using group me's and your classmates to your advantage. If you guys are all in the same class, why not help each other out? If you uh, are having trouble with a certain topic in class, then hey, talk to them. Talk in the group me. They will actually help you because some other people will probably have the same question. And also, they can help you out with due dates if you maybe forgot to put in your calendar. I've had this happen, sadly. I thought I had everything planned, everything organized in my planner, and then there was an assignment that I missed in my calendar and so someone was asking a question about that assignment and I was like what what are they talking about we don't have something due this week and so you better make sure you read those groupies even if you have them on do not disturb 
read them once in a while because they might be reminding you to do your work. All right guys, that is it for today's video. If you like school related content like this, give this video a like and also subscribe to my channel down below. If you wanna see more from me, I post every Tuesdays and Thursdays on this channel. And also I post like almost every day on Instagram. So you should like check that out. It will be on the screen now and also my Twitter as well. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.